<تصفيق> هاي Let's learn English through short stories. مرحبا خلينا نتعلم اللغة الإنجليزية من خلال قصة رائعة جدا بهذا الكورس المميز قصص إنجليزية قصيرة مهمة جدا. خلينا الآن نطلب على اللغة الإنجليزية. Hi, let's learn English through short stories. You have to get ready before we begin with today's story. Okay? You need a. إذا كنت متابع الحلقات الماضية راح تعرف شنو أقصد. شو اسمه هذا؟ And a yes, a pen and a notebook. Let's begin with today's new words first. خلنا نأخذ كلمات اليوم أولاً نشرحهم بالتفصيل واختبارك من هذه الحلقة هو إنه تكون جملة مفيدة على كل كلمة من هذه الكلمات. Husband, town. Quiet, country, angry, loved. الماضي لفعل love يضحك. Get, got. يحصل أو حصل على. Got. الماضي لفعل get. Husband. Town. Quiet. Country. Angry. Loved, get, got. Mumtaz. Okay, let's begin now with today's story. Mrs. Harris lives in a small village. Her husband is dead. But she has one son. He is 21 and his name is Jeff. He worked in the shop in the village and lived with his mother but then he got work in a town and went and lived there its name was green sea it was quite long way from his mother's village and she was not happy about it but jeff said there isn't any good work for me in the country mother and I can get a lot of money in green sea and send you some money every week mrs. Harris was very angry last Saturday she got in a train and went to her son's house in green sea then she said to him Jeff why do you never phone me Jeff laughed. But mother, he said, you haven't got a phone. No, she answered. I haven't, but you have got one. The end. Let's take today's new words again. Husband, town, quiet, country, angry, loved, الماضي لفعل love يضحك get got يحصل أو حصل على got الماضي لفعل get husband town quiet country angry loved get got ممتاز جيد بعد الانتهاء خلينا ناخذ قصة جديدة بهذه السلسلة وإذا تريدون باقي القصص تلقوها أسفل هذا الفيديو في التعليق لا تنسى الإعجاب والاشتراك في القناة حتى تحصل على المزيد من الدروس إلى اللقاء Hi guys Let's learn English through short stories Before we begin with today's episode, you need a pen and a notebook because you have to write all new phrases and new words. And remember to read aloud five times each word, each sentence. Let's begin with today's new words. 
كوايت ستريت شارع هذا كوايت هذا ستريت شارع كوايت ستريت نيبرز نيبرز جيران at the side of the river في طرف النهر at the side of the river at the side of the river shown shown الفعل الماضي للفعل shine يشرق shown أشرقت ماضي فعل shine shown أشرقت anywhere anywhere behind behind خلف behind خلف quietly quietly بهدوء towards towards باتجاه باتجاه towards towards إذا خلينا نقرأهن مرة ثانية هذه الثمان كلمات اللي عندنا ونحفظها ولا تنسى الاختبار إنه تكون جملة على كل كلمة من هذه الكلمات الجديدة وتكتب بالتعليق هذه الجمل الجديدة في نهاية هذه الحلقة إذا quiet street neighbors at the side of of the river at the side of the river shown anywhere behind quietly Two words. Mumtaz. Okay, let's begin with today a new story and focus with me. Two old gentlemen lived in a quiet street in Paris. They were friends and neighbors and they often went for walks together in the streets when the weather was fine. Last Saturday, they went for a walk at the side of the river. The sun shone, the weather was warm. There were a lot of flowers everywhere and there were boats on the water. The two men walked happily for half an hour. And then one of them said to the other, There is a very beautiful girl. Where can you see a beautiful girl? said the other. I can't see one anywhere. I can see two young men. They are walking towards us. The girls walking behind us said the first man quietly. But how can you see her then? asked his friend. The first man smiled and said, I can't see her, but I can see the young man's eyes. Let's take today's new words again. <laughs> Quiet street, شارع هذا. Quiet, هذا. Street, شارع. Quiet street, neighbors, neighbors, جيران. At the side of the river, في طرف النهر. At the side of the river, at the side of the river. Shown, shown. الفعل الماضي للفعل shine, يشرق. Shown, أشرقت. ماضي فعل shine. Shown أشرقت Anywhere Anywhere Behind Behind خلف Behind خلف Quietly Quietly بهدوء Towards Towards باتجاه باتجاه Towards Towards إذا خلينا نقرأهن مرة ثانية هذه الثمان كلمات اللي عندنا ونحفظها ولا تنسى الاختبار انه تكون جملة على كل كلمة من هذه الكلمات الجديدة وتكتب بالتعليق هذه الجمل الجديدة في نهاية هذه الحلقة إذا quiet street neighbors at the side of, of the river at the side of the river shown anywhere behind quietly Two words. Mumtaz. Two old gentlemen lived in a quiet street in Paris. They were friends and neighbors in the streets when the weather was fine. 
Last Saturday, they went for a walk at the side of the river. The sun shone, the weather was warm. There were a lot of flowers everywhere and there were boats on the water. The two men walked happily for half an hour and then one of them said to the other there is a very beautiful girl where can you see a beautiful girl said the other I can't see one anywhere I can see two young men they are walking towards us the girls walking behind us said the first man quietly but how can you see her then asked his friend the first man smiled and said i can't see her but i can see the young man's eyes let's take today's new words again okay the end see you tomorrow with a new story don't forget to click on like subscribe and cheer bye hi guys let's learn english through short stories before we begin with today's episode you need a pen and a notebook because you have to write all new phrases and new words and remember to read aloud five times each word each sentence let's begin with today's new words lonely 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 اقرأ lonely وحيداً lonely وحيداً in front of في أمام أو أمام الشيء in front of in front of a lot of a lot of كثيراً من كثيراً من هذا الشيء مثلاً a lot of beer 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 evening evening مساء اقرأ معي evening evening furniture furniture أثاث furniture furniture هيا نقرأهم سويا أنا وأنت lonely in front of a lot of beer evening furniture okay let's begin with today a new story and focus with me today's story talking about a small village white bridge was a small village and old people came and lived there some of them had a lot of old furniture and they often didn't want some of it because they were in a smaller house now so every saturday morning they put it out and other people came and looked at it and sometimes they took it away because they wanted it every saturday mr and mrs morton put a very ugly old bear's head out at the side of their gate but nobody wanted it the last saturday they wrote i am a very lonely here please take me on a piece of paper and put it near the bear's head they went to the town and came home in the evening there were now two bears heads in front of their house and there was another piece of paper it said i was lonely too 
Let's take today's new words again. Lonely, 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 lonely. اقرأ معي. Lonely, وحيداً. Lonely, وحيداً. In front of, في أمام أو أمام الشيء. In front of, in front of. A lot of, a lot of. كثيراً من. كثيراً من هذا الشيء مثلاً. A lot of. Beer, beer, beer. Evening, evening. مساء. اقرأ معي. Evening, evening. Furniture, furniture. أثاث. Furniture, furniture. هيا نقرأهم سوياً أنا وأنت. Lonely, in front of, a lot of, beer, evening, furniture. Okay, the end. See you tomorrow with a new story. Don't forget to click on like, subscribe, and share. Bye!